Would you like to have more focus during your day? Here's my advice. Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to the channel, I'm Joey Bull and I'm a fitness professional and I make YouTube videos on well-being. This video should give you some help and advice if you're struggling to achieve your goals, whether they're daily tasks or more significant objectives. There's quite a lot we can do that can improve our focus and be really effective, but I'm just going to give you some pointers here so that you can get on with it straight away and start seeing results. In this video, I'm going to cover mindset, body and vision. Getting into the flow. Work out what you want. What is it that you wish to focus on and what for and why? And what will it bring you? And how much will it bring you? And is what you want for the short or long-term future? Get it down, write it down. There's nothing like writing on the back of the envelope for your best ideas to be realized. You can have an illustrative list in many ways, a mind map, a focus wheel, or just a normal list. This way, it will give you a lot more direction. And also you could possibly order it in a way of priority what you wish to realize first. Use feeling to help focus. Get into the mindset of asking yourself why you want what you want. This will give it some momentum and propulsion. And then this way that you can build on the excitement of why am I doing this? It might just be for the progress. It might just be for tuning into something and feeling good about it. It might be for the getting better at something. Just get excited about what is going to be coming from your focus. If focus is an issue for you, think about your diet. Refined food, processed foods, alcohol and sugar are known to fog the brain. So go for foods which are more rich in nutrients. Talking of which, coconut fat can really improve brain function. They have done trials on Alzheimer's patients and the cognitive this was a cognitive ability test based on language and orientation so if there's improvement in an already degenerated Alzheimer's brain imagine what we can get out of an already healthy functioning brain it's a great way to protect the brain from future degeneration there'll be a link in the description below as to where you can get some holding your focus on something while you're actually doing it is one thing but holding focus with a wandering mind just in your thoughts is another matter particularly when stress is involved. Stress is considered by the brain to be a priority, so it can be very distracting. Pick your best times to focus. You may have perfect moments during the day to find your focus, but the best time is on awakening, and that's because the day isn't cluttered up already, and also you've had a good sleep when the brain has been dejunct. So now is the moment to really fine tune those thoughts and things that you want to focus on. Give these thoughts really good feeling, get excited about them, really see it through, and that way you're going to embed it into the subconscious mind all the more. Pick a time that works for you and almost give it a slot, a beginning and an end, and that way your focus will be much more concentrated and effective. Practice focusing. You can practice whenever, wherever, to amplify your results. Practice now in whatever you're doing. For instance, with movement, whatever the motion, try and act it out perfectly with precision. Test your balance, your technique, your timing of things and execute it brilliantly. This way you're laying down new neural pathways so that the focus becomes a habit to help to learn to focus. If you're running or if you're just walking, you can practice focusing on what you're doing, really break down the motion. For instance, whatever the action, place the foot properly, think of the angles, think of the balance, fore and back, the extension, be the manager of the move, fix the vision ahead of you. Whatever the action, just execute it perfectly. You can also just listen. I know it sounds silly, but don't forget we're just practicing here. Just listen to all the sounds around you. Even close your eyes and count how many sounds there are. The wind, the rustling of the leaves, the buzz of the fridge, whatever it is, just focus on those sounds. You could also use your eyes and actually sharpen up your vision. Improved sensory perception can be found to improve your creativity, your your learning ability and your memory. To change the focal length of the lens and the internal muscles of the eyeballs, you can start by looking at something close about six inches away from your eyes and look short, 
and then far. You can look out to the horizon or long way. Repeat this exercise for about 15 times without straining. By practicing focus like this, we lay down new neural pathways so that it becomes second nature. Thank you for watching and I hope that you found this helpful and that you can achieve your focus a little bit better now. If you've got any questions, please leave a comment below. And if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like and you can subscribe to my channel. I upload every Monday. Once again, there'll be a link in the description below for where you can get some coconut fat. Bye, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.